Hey everyone, welcome back to Cyberpunk 2077. I've downloaded the new patch that came out, so hopefully things will run smoother today. I'm um, also yeah, taking some of this for my motion sickness. So I took this half an hour ago, I said it will settle in. Yeah, hopefully this will help my dizziness, otherwise I don't know if I can enjoy this game. <laughs> but I have also changed the settings a bit. I was reading up other people who were getting motion sickness from this and they've increased their depth of field. Uh, and got rid of some motion blur and some other settings so I'm trying that out today hopefully this helps and this is 100% ginger root so it's not bad for my body which I'm happy about uh, and yeah let's go part two let's continue on with the story All right, let's go to the last time Jackie oh almost there forgot should get Wakako on the hollow tell her the job's done Access your phone. T bug. Oh, Wakako. Okay, it's just our boss. Wakako Okada. Okay, Hello. Japanese. V. How did it go? Our client is alive and well. Relatively speaking. Oh, relatively well. Trauma team took her off our hands. She'll recover. Splendid. Your payment awaits you. Ready to come and grab whenever you like, even right away. But I guess home is the only place you wish to be now. The NCPD yeah. has surrounded Watson. The district is closed. If you're to make it past the cordon, you must move fast. Thanks for the heads up. Swing by to see you later. Word's out the NCPD is gonna put Watson on lockdown. I'm gonna sleep in my own bed tonight. We better put in fifth. Leave it to me, chica. I'm driving. Hey. Oh, cool. I'm glad you're driving. Pretty disastrous last time when I was driving. So we're working for a that lady just now, Wakata. We're working for her. But yeah, it looks like the background stuff is not fixed, eh? You can see the palm trees in the back there. Oh well, hopefully it doesn't pop out too much. <laughs> oh. Stop digging Night City. Oof. City like any other. Just bigger. Ah, oh, Chica. Not just any other city. Morgan Blackhand. Andrew Wayland. Adam Smasher. Legends are born here. Oh man, this palm tree's popping. Damn, I wanna enjoy it without those <laughs> floating think? palm trees. Jackie, they're locking down Watson, remember? Oh shit, man, you're right. Is it just me or oh, I could know it? Man on her ass, tailing us. Oh, oh, who is tailing us? Fuck it, run, Jackie! Come on, V! Can't keep her steady! Yeah, I can't. For the movement, I can't shoot them. Oh. Excuse me. We should shoot the driver, eh? V! Aim for the driver! Yeah, I'm trying to. Oh, nice. Just another day in that city, I'm guessing. Crushed your baby up pretty bad. Sorry, V. It's okay. Not Thank your you fault. Let's just focus on getting home. Man, those palm trees, eh? Hmm. It's a bit distracting. It's kind of like distracting me from being real immersive in this world. So I wonder if there's any other settings I can change. Hmm. Damn. I'm pulling out all the stops. El Guapo. Kabuki. Oh. Reinforcements. Oh no, policemen. What does the lockdown to for the nerdist? Necessary security measure. Officer, ma'am! Damn, are we ever lucky we ran into you. Really? What's it that makes me so special? Uh, heart of gold? 
because only somebody with a heart of gold can understand just how much I need to get back to my girl. Your girl? He's got a date, ma'am. Uh-huh. I'm gonna be worried sick if I don't show. Got a date with I Misty. Mean, I'm trying to be a stand-up guy. Is she giving me a chance? Waiting. Hmm. That's a shame. Look at him. No model citizen, maybe, but he's a good kid. Got a good heart. Come on, officer. Let them through. But they're the last. Yay, yay, yay. Okay. On your like way. You have a good evening now, officer, ma'am. We got a date with Misty. Oh, Jackie's got a date. So you can be nice. She took a liking to you. So you can be nice when you feel like it. When am I not nice? Um, always. <laughs> I'm always never not nice. But it's a bit confusing. Always never not nice. Little China. This is nice. We get to... Oh, I was going to say it's nice how we're just getting to cruise through the city. Being passenger, but... Cruise... Got cut short. Doesn't look like your average bust. This ain't your average badges. That's Max Tack. Okay, within 10 minutes, 32 gun shows. Tack rolls in when things fly out of hand. Gunk's out there, though. Just a midday snack for him. Well, she was over. Poor bastards. But they had it coming. Uh, if you're riding as a passenger, you can press B to skip the ride and arrive immediately at your destination. And I'm enjoying it at the moment. It's our first time looking at actual Night City. So... I'm gonna enjoy the view of it. Almost at your place. What about you? Not likely to make it back to Haywood now. Kill V? Don't let me through. You sure about that? Oh yeah. I'll play nice Jackie again. <laughs> Wide open. What is that advertising? Huh? <laughs> that was our apartment block. Sweet dreams, then. Have a good day. I said hi. I will. I wish I knew Spanish. So I can understand what Jackie's saying. Oh. Any brands we know? Oh, yeah, there we go. Hey, it's the MC dude. Bug? Forgot earlier. A runner I know has something you could probably use. Zip in your deeds. The task T-Bug has given you is an important step on the path to developing your net running skills. And... I didn't read the last bit. Ooh. Hello, night city. Mac and cheeses. <laughs> All right. Hey guys. Hey neighbors. What you're up to? Alright. Hey, vending machines. Burritos. Can we use these? No. Just for show. Doesn't look like a safe place we stay at. Nap there. Where's our house? Oh, there. Can I grab that? How come it keeps popping up? Anyway, let's get out of here. Oh. 
whiskey. Oh, Dick and whiskey. Tick. On our PC. Messages. Mega medicine. Lottery. Alert, you've been attacked. Ah. Your junk mail. Cola. Energy drinks. Hey, our place is not too bad, even though the outside looks kind of rough, you know. Look in the mirror. Check ourselves out. Hey, V. Stop looking. Smile. <laughs> hey, is that the smile? Okay. Gal. How come her, her expression's not changing? Out. I swear her expression's not changing. Walk. Uh, yeah. Her expression doesn't change at all. Oh, slightly. Hardly. <laughs> Stare. Can hardly tell. A shower. A bed. Test everything out. Honestly, our place looks real good, eh? Healed up. Alright. Okay, you can switch between jo active job objectives of down. Ah. Oh. Whoa, V. You get your beauty sleep? <laughs> no matter. Time you got up. I think I might have caught something. When I jacked into that corpo's biomon. I know a neurovirus or I need to see Vic. Let him tell me what's got my head reeling and my stomach churning. Okay, let me take you. I brought you a ride. Yeah, throw on some threads, meet me downstairs. Uh, where's like our uh, quests? Be the journal. Oh, your main job. Side job. And I've got skill point. I can probably level up. Attributes, okay. Handguns. Yeah, actually handguns. I need that to level up. Eagle Eye. Reduces time to aim down sight with rifles and submachines. it for now. Oh, let's check what I have. With us. What? Let's check out our new outfit. Oh, yeah, what happened? What happened to our hair? Ah. Oh. What did I do to my hair? I thought I was wearing a hat. Let's change. Inventory. Oh yeah, we're meant to look like that. How come we look like we were bald? Hmm. Anyway. Let's go. Who's Regina? Hey V. Regina Jones here. If you're looking for work in Watson, give me a call. How did you find me? How'd you even know my name? I know where to gather my intel. Could even call me a collector. Later, V. Okay. Oh. Some drama. 
Oh, little kids. It's not a really good place to grow up, is it? I don't know what these are. I'm just looting. Okay, let's go to Yoko. Yeah, there's obviously a poor area of Night City, I'm guessing. Or is it really poor, or is the whole place just like this? The whole city? Me neither, I'm just trying to grab your shit. Ah, oh, sometimes I can grab the stuff. Oh, okay, you gotta get like the right spot and angle. Ramen? Hey. How about a round or two? What do you say? Uh. How you like my new punching bag? Mm. Just gave me a next gen ass whooping. He did. Be curious. That's cool. See how he handles the likes of me. They have actual androids so to fight against to train. Uh, not today. No, not today. Thanks anyway. Next time. Whatever. I'll be here. Oh yeah. This is a makeshift gym. So many things to see. Oh, look at that. That looks like a nicer, richer area. The area we're staying in just looks like a kind of no, like a garbage can, just people on drugs and just people who are very lost living on the streets. A lot of lost energy around here. Just grab this ammo just that's lying around. Collect your gun from Wilson. Oh yeah, there we go. Let's have a look. Uh oh this one? Cool. Free? And that's it. You've just received an iconic item along with a set of crafting specs. You can use these to craft better quality versions of this item. When a new version of an iconic item is crafted, the original item is destroyed. Iconic items can also be upgraded just like regular weapons or pieces of clothing. Upgrading improves their levels and stats, ensuring the, they remain useful as you progress through the game. Thanks a lot. Thanks for the free gun. Was it free? Did I pay? <laughs> Where to next? Got our gun. Guess I'm going down. Retrieve the pin quick hook from the net runner. Man, this is like so much is happening. You're just trying to digest and take everything in. Alright. Where is Yoko? Oh, what happened? NCPD scanner hustles. The NPCD will pay you to help fight crime. NCPD gigs fixes will contact you when you approach a gigs location. Fixes. These in intermediary uh, these intermediaries will inform you about local gigs available. Okay. He's full. Oh man, this is gonna be so overwhelming. Oh, so much happening. Real water. <laughs> Is it hard to find real water nowadays? Oh, let's talk to this. Earn some cash, eh? Oh, I guess I'll help Jackie first since he's right hour. here. Jeez. They took you long enough. Looked up an appetite just waiting. I'm just trying to Sit digest down, everything, man. This. Drop in on Senor Vector. What's you eating? figure you as the type for Asian. Who thought you'd find it too exotic? What do you mean? What's there not to like? Noodles? Check. Synth sirloin? 
Jack. Chile action over here, and you're looking at Mama Well's signature sopa de fideos. Okay, let's try. I'm just gonna try change the setting, see if I can get rid of those palm trees that keeps popping up. Oh, wait, did it work? <gasps> I think it worked. <gasps> those palm trees are gone. Yay! I'm so happy. <gasps> oh yes, I can finally focus now on my surroundings. Oh yes, I'm so happy. This is honestly so cool. Man, these instances, I wish I had like a curved screen so I feel like I'm really in this world. But honestly, it looks so good so far, even just like this. I'll be back, Jackie. Gonna experience this town. You can hear Japanese in the background. Oh, look at this, it's like a cyber monk. It's like a monk outfit. Oh, this is awesome. But man, it doesn't look like a safe place to live in though, eh, Night City? Like, you have to be street smart to survive in this world. Mentioned something okay. about a surprise yesterday. Am I remembering right, or just Tell that brain fart? Probably both, because you usually forget shit. But it just so System happens... System malfunction. I think I might have bagged us a sweet-ass J-O-B. Go on. I mean, maybe it's not as big as that, but... Just that he's fronted by a little-known someone named Dexter Deshaun. Only the top fixer in night fucking city. Badass black Jesus of the afterlife. 300 pounds of partly gold plated coup. Tell me more about Dick. Dexter Deshaun. What's the latest spec on him? No, you got info to spill. He's been off the grid for about two years. Word on the street was he took a little vacay. Two years? That's exile, not a vacation. How was he up to? Uh, guessing he shoved pizzas in his mouth while jerking off to hardcore virtues. The important thing is... Virtues? Is that the word for porn? Nowadays? Us. I mean, in this world. So what's the gig? We meant to come out in one piece? Well, our savior wants to tell you everything himself. Face to face. No pressure, but... Old deal's riding on you now, chica. How come, um, that system malfunction keeps popping up? Why do I gotta go? You and T-Bug draw straws without me? T-Bug and Dex go way back, and my face is yesterday's news. Now Dex says he needs to check you, talk to you. Okay. Look, V, it's his job, <laughs> Floating his chopsticks. I can't blame him for taking a personal <laughs> approach. And it ain't as bad as you think, okay? Trust me. Guess I got no choice then. <laughs> I'm just gonna enjoy these bugs when it comes Dex up. Is a real deal when it comes to fixers. Don't get me wrong. Don't got nothing against the Padre or Wakako, but Dex is in a league of his own. You know what I'm saying? No, my way around fixers. Don't get me started on fixers. They catch a client, find the cheapest gonk to do the job, then drop their corpse at a landfill. Shit, hit the nail on the head, V. Gracias, a Dios. Brought your wheels. Gave them to my guy yesterday to smooth over the dents after our uh, dust up the scabs. Thanks. Thanks, Jack. Much appreciated. You can call your active vehicle to your current location. Sweet. Our horse is here, guys. Some top notch work Miguel did. Our Rides horse is like here. Looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. So we rolling or what? That our ride? Let's go. Let's feel this factory new ride. That's our roach. Roach is here. <laughs> Get in. Cool, oh my gosh, I'm so happy. Oh, damn it. I thought. Ripper dog. Damn it. I thought I wasn't driving. Easy on the gas, eh? I just ate. Okay. Yeah. I'll try to be gentle. I was supposed how to stop do I by switch? Oh, there we go. It's easier. Misty. You don't say. 
Oh, so those palm sweet. trees are popping up again. It really gets me, you know. Okay, let's not cause any chaos or kill anyone. Let's just press down my button gently. I mean, it's so hard to drive proper in these games, eh? Eesh. All right, go. Oh, this is so cool. We're in the city. All right, how do I park? Cool. Yeah, this is it. Come on, v. Find me one oh, I can already hear gunshots. Well, Hidden gems. While exploring Night City. Oh, I missed that little tip. Okay, where are, where are those gunshots? Man, half the people walking on the streets just, they look drunk and on drugs, eh? Preaching. What are these gigs? Uh, just see, there's a icon above you that I want to activate. Oh well. Let's just carry on. Misty's esoterica. Yeah, we get to meet hey, Misty. Hey. Doctor hey. Doctor, we'll see you now. I'll sit tight over here. Me and Misty got a little catching up to do. So these two are dating? Cute. Cards. <laughs> you girls all good? <laughs> Everyone just seems real high in this place. What's up here? Man, people are just passed out on the streets. It's just the homeless, eh? Alright, let's go down. Ripper Dock. Though a common practice, cyberware installation is still a dangerous and invasive procedure which can only be performed by qualified specialists, Ripper Docks. There are several Ripper Docks operating throughout Night City who offer a variety of different cyberware upgrades. Select your desired cybernet tech upgrade from the list and enjoy your new abilities. Okay, it's cool. So it's this as ever, you old ripper. an official legal thing? Good to see you too, V. It's been a while. Hey, well he's watching boxing. What do I owe the pleasure today? Last gig. Had to jack into a client's neuro socket. Think I might have gotten Ah, oh, That's why the system malfunction nausea, is showing. Sensitivity to bright lights. Oh, kit and caboodle. Alright, kit. We'll sort you out in a flash. Isaac, how are nice. things? Heard of Dexter Deshawn? Met a new fixer. Gave me a job. Name's Dexter Deshawn. Known quantity from the afterlife. No denying you're moving up. But something you're not telling me, Vic? Keep your guard up. That's all. I've heard some things about Dex. He's not as chill as he makes himself out to be. All right. Need some new kit. But tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. <laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job from Dex to Sean. Hitting the major leagues. Need tech that can perform. Ooh. Cool the hand, Dexter dude. Dexter to Sean? <laughs> well, that is something. But let I sent some sarcasm there. Hasn't paid you yet. When she said the. Uh, pay you once the job's done. Got no Quit money. Crying, Vic. I'll bring you the Eddies later with interest. You know I will. Mm. Ooh, Android arm. Last time. You here? Oh. Oh. Chair, please. You're gonna stick that in Sit me? Down. Relax. Are those tools or fingers? Roshi optics. Best I've got, and should be about right under the circumstances. Oh, whoa. Does he? <laughs> he uses his fingers. Now, Jack in. 
All right. That's top shelf tick. Groshy, whoa! Vic, nothing tops that on the market. Hmm. Sounds like it could come in handy then. I gave you my word I'd pay you back, but this might be too rich for my blood. We'll work something out. Right now, I'm just out to make sure you get back in one piece. Eddie's in hand. Thanks. I trust you. You peruse and choose while I scan. See Man, this is freaky, inside. eh? Because it's like people can just hack you, right? Just plugging something inside you. Cybernetic implants are mechanical replacements for the organic parts of your body. They can give you superhuman like abilities, which can improve your combat capability and help you survive in hazardous conditions. Although common practice in 2077, the installation of cyberware is still an invasive and sometimes dangerous medical procedure. Yeah, that's what I was just thinking. Only specialists known as Ripper Doctors are trusted to install cyberware safely. Yeah, this is this makes you so vulnerable, right? Just sticking a connection into your head can mess you up. Okay, what do we do? Open. Hiroshi Optics. Hiroshi Optical Cyber is a widely popular suite composed of electro and neural enhancements with environment scanning functionality. Yeah. Do we just buy all of them? <laughs> and hands. Ooh, we're going to get an Android hand. Ballistic co-processor. Increases the chance to ricochet shots with power weapons. Directly links the user's optical implant to the weapon system, offering real-time data tracking. All sounds very useful. I'm just going to take it all then. I think I'm, I will just do the default for now, and once I know more about this game, I'll Mark get one later. Like I said, decent enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Cherry on the top's a built-in external lens disruptor. In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your face as a blur. Hey, Just remember, that's your useful. body will still show up as crystal clear. The important part is mm. the face. This should do the trick. That's all good then. Talks to Kuroshi Tech too. I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Let's do this. Whew. You have to really trust. Arm of yours right here. You really have to trust the person who's doing so, this on you. What's new in the life of Victor Vector? <sighs> yeah, if I'm being honest, not much. And that's fine with me. I used to live in a world where all that mattered was who's who, what's what, and how's why. And what happened? One day I just dropped it and never looked back. I'll never be a legend in this town been sleeping nights ever since it's good good to have a peaceful life just like that thanks now a bit of anesthetic and I can start cutting Oof. feel anything feels like I'm at the dentist though? really doc makes you sound like a dentist always going on and on don't be mean now Remember, I'm old. I got a shaky Gannic hand. Could slip. Ooh. Lights out for a Ooh. minute, all right? Ooh. Whoa. <laughs> we trust you, Doc. Trust you, Victor. Okay, let's test this. See the magic in action. Linking you in. Hey. You might feel a little discomfort at first. Blurred vision. I see myself. Contrast, glitches. Oh, this is the eyeball that he's holding, eh? Well, oh, yeah. How's it look? Feel all right to you? That's it. Seen more dramatic improvements before. Patience, kid. Give it a minute. Scanning people with your optical cyberware can provide you with a lot of useful information, such as how strong an enemy might be, who is in their crew, or what type of weapon they use. As a skilled net runner, you can see a list of quick hacks which you can use against your enemies. Time for the scanner. Man, this is like so dangerous 
because you just get all this info from everyone about everyone and just makes it so easy to be a stalker in this world. It might take you a few seconds to adjust, but first time's really the charm with anything really. Scanner should eventually sync with your thought processes and read your intentions. <laughs> this is the ultimate stalker tool. NCPD file search. Run into any ne'er do wells? <laughs> you know exactly what they ne'er did well. Oh, it says he's the best rip docker, doctor. Database of individuals with bounties assigned to them is now available to use. You can identify these wanted persons with your scanner. Since all are wanted dead or alive, the methods you use to claim your reward are entirely up to you. <laughs> it auto Ooh, like it's it got, I'm half Android <laughs> now. <laughs> you should see your ammo count My in first Android piece. Oh, I'm part Android now. Thanks, Victor. What about the virus? How about that... the neurovirus from the last job? Can you check it? Done and gone while we were putting in your implant. And a full sweep on your soft and circuit. Oh, sweet. Zap the critter. You're certified bug free. Nice and easy. Shit, Victor, not bad. I don't know what to say. Pay you back, man. So Pay you back once I've done the job. The two whiffs now, and another two in an hour. Wait, what am I looking at? A mild stim. Should boost neurotransmission in the short term and muffle some of the side effects while the implant takes. Wait. You're the best yeah. thing. I owe you. It's just like inhalers, eh? Go on, kid. Show cool. what you're made of. Thanks, yeah, it's said big he's... Leagues. Don't forget where you came from. Yeah, the best Ripper Doc in Watts oh in Watson. Guard Old up, friend idiot. of Jackie Wells. Hey. What's second so I'll move your ass chica? Dex is waiting on us. Okay, let's go back. V, yo, listen up. I talked to Dex while you Sorry, were in with the doc. Misty. He's waiting in his ride for you. Ain't but a hop to where he's parked next to Gramsci Burgers. Okay, do my best to talk us up. Okay, so Jackie's not coming. V, Regina, listen. I've got this delicate matter. That's why I called you. The number of cyber psycho attacks in the city is on the rise. Now, that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tack hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. Okay, so it shows so many quests. Hmm. Yeah, various ways to incapitate enemies without killing them. Non-lethal takedowns, non-lethal quick hacks, non-lethal weapons, grenades, and some combat gadgets. Weapon mods that change damage to non-lethal. Let's just get this quest over with with Dex. Beat cop. Beat cop. Oh. What's happening? Oh! Heads down! What's happening? Racketeer. It's two, like, different clans fighting against each other. What is happening? I don't know what's happening, I'm just gonna... <laughs> Do I interfere? Ah, this guy. This is Dex. Hey. I remember this dude. Yo, Miss V. A pleasure. Dexter Deshaun in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> 
Let's roll. Oh, nice ride. Mind if I ask you something right off the bangle? Would you rather live in peace as Miss Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your thirtieth? Uh, Miss Nobody's don't survive in nice in Night City. Yeah, that's true. You're either somebody or you fizzle out into nothing. Night City don't let you choose. Oh, but it does. See, in my line of work, I choose to be Mr. Chill. But folk who try to take advantage, well, they see the beast inside. All right, listen close. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scab home. Why mate me? Hang on, got a question of my own now. Why all this, Dex? Why me? Could have had Jackie or T-Bug sitting here. Could have just done this on comms. Call me old-fashioned. I like to look anyone I do biz with in the eye. Had the pleasure of meeting the Jackster in the past, and Sweet T Bug helped this brother out two years ago. So here we are. Besides all that, got a special little pre mission just for you. But we'll get to that. All right, let me What's hear. What's the it. job? What's the job? There's this prototype tech, a biochip to be precise. Jobs to grab it. Simple. Mm. What are you hiding? <laughs> Guessing it belongs to a corp. Mm -hmm. It's not simple. It's not sure, going to be simple. No uh, that's a death sentence? No, no problem. Just a death sentence. And sees Arasaka's turf. Nobody fucks with them here. What can I say, Miss V? How risk, how reward. First rule of the afterlife. Besides that, I'm no leadhead. Ain't gonna leave no trace for them to follow because we're gonna do this clean and on the hush hush. We understand each other. You work right. this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs active resolving that. Second, the rendezvous. Simple. Client who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. Who's her? Client. What's her thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End the convo. <laughs> anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, we'll be there for a long. <laughs> little palm trees on his beard. <laughs> Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty okay. So you think I'm the best fit for the job? What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot in the shard. Sure. Got a classic tale for you. Psycho gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a military convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, Convoy was carrying the Flathead, a little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high-grade military team. Okay. If we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. The problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate, one Simon Randall, aka Royce, plain oh. dropped his ass. Drama within the, Royce the is tribe. In now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. To add to the system, one Meredith Pretty lady. Militech has developed an Merida. interest in said convoy. Who's the woman? Who's the prima donna? <laughs> Corpo agent, internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter. So she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. 
think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is going to be all you. All right. Let's earn this money. One more thing, Miss V. Quiet life or blaze of glory? Hmm? Blaze of glory, I guess. That's the Later life we've, he's got to live, right? Okay, where'd you drop me off? Forming certain actions will reward you with street cred. Build your street cred by making a name for yourself in the Night City Underworld. Doing so will open up new opportunities. Oh yeah, let's make the people like us. Jackster, talk to Dex. Oh! <laughs> yeah, Gordito's a big deal. <laughs> Literally at night, yeah? Wants to check us out, see if we got what it takes. Guy certainly knows how to protect his biz. Wants to put us on a few small kinks. Prep work, I guess. Before lining us up a big job. This fee have a little something to get those taste buds tingling. The biochip in question is in fact the so-called relic. A Novatia piece of tech catering to the top 1%. Supposedly the best life insurance money can buy. You and I are going to be neck deep in euros money. There's this combat bot military prototype. Maelstrom clipped it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had a switch up in management. I right, heard about that. Royce versus Brick. Hostile takeover. About sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deeds of some Militech agent too, but don't know how much help she stands to be. <laughs> Sing on. Stalk everyone here. Royce. Yeah, he don't sound thrilled. Royce, what do you know about him? He's fucking whack something special. Junkie snort junk. Royce snorts chrome. Then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Yeah, Parker well... wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. He must know what he's doing. So, how you want to play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? Uh, let's go meet the client, Evelyn Parker. Parker, think I ought to see her first. See what she's like, what she's after. Orale. In that case, I'll hit the all foods. Put my nose to the ground. Sniff around. Hasta luego. Oh, this is a fast traveling thing. Oh yeah, cool. Fast travel. So, looks like we found the last honest cop in this city. Her name's Anna Hamill, and whatever she's investigating, it's made her a lot of enemies. She'd do best to cut it out if you catch my drift. Okay, look, I know how it sounds, but... Somebody would have taken this gig anyway, right? I don't know. Maybe there's an angle you can play here. Either way, info's attached. Okay. Maybe I can help her out. V, oh, she keeps calling me. Block. Who doesn't, right? Thing is, these rats are human-sized. Look just like tiger claws, too. Biggest one is a certain Taki Kinmochi. So do your fixer a solid and neutralize her ass, will ya? Deeds attached. Man, you got a lot of jobs for me, Regina. One thing at a time. Hey. We're closed right now. I need to talk to Evelyn. Oh yes, it's to go between 6 to 6 a.m. I guess um, for now I'll do that quest um, thing that T-Bug gave us. Track this. Uh, let's go do the T-Bug. T-Bug's quest. <laughs> hey! Oh pfft. Okay, I thought it was a dude, that's a car. Okay, I should probably watch where I'm going. Okay, that's realistic. <laughs> but I survived that. It could be just because I'm superhuman. Okay, I'm glad that the um, this time round, the there aren't as many bugs, so I'm quite happy. The trees aren't.
copping out as much. Okay, Yoko. Where are you? But yeah, the city looks like people have like given up on it. No one's cleaning it. There's no pride in the city anymore. Hey, Yoko. T-Bug sent me. Said you'd have something for me. Got a Militech Paraline. Think it'll do. I guess I am a okay. beginner. Glad to grab a demon always. Yeah. Alright, uh, what's a... Ping. Reveals enemies and devices connected to the local network. That's it. Whipping quick hacks in your cyber deck. Your cyber deck has a limited capacity for quick hacks, but you are free to swap out which ones you have installed on it whenever you wish to do so. Go to your inventory. Alright, let's go. How's this work? Any punk off the street can waltz in here, grab some shady running soft. Alright, let's go to inventory. Uh, cyberware? Quick hacks. Click the cyber deck slot in your inventory to open mod screen. Oh, there it is. Okay, what is this? Oh, these are the two mods. So I only got two slots. Like, I'm guessing I can have more slots later. I can skip time. It's like meditation in The Witcher. Upload ping to the camera to find access point. So, ping. Use your personal link to connect to the access point and hack it. Uh, okay. Man, this is so buzzy, we're just tracking everything. Uh, 1C. We go 1C. B5. How do I figure this out? Oh, let's try again. I'm confused. Okay. So I think the trick is to select a column with the same... with the uh, codes that you need. The information. Go to Lizzie's bar. Let's skip. Oh, whoops. Skip too much ahead. Go back to 6 p.m. Hey there, doll face. Hey. Interest you in a preem BD? Brain dance. What do you got? What don't we got? Women and men of your dreams. Synaptic acting A-listers, no washed up virtue porn boy toys, or blow up dolls here. Oh, tur stuff. It'll grip your heart and blow your nerves right out of your body. Pure bit-based ecstasy. That's why people come here. Clearly know how to sell it. Not a sales pitch, it's a warning. I'll give you one word. Bespoke. Not for everyone's synapses. Think you can handle it? Uh, another tie. Oh, should I do it? I don't know. Let's try. Oh. Damn, that sounds promising. I get it. I'm in. Mm-hmm. Couple of things you need to know first. 
<clears throat> Severe penalties for any unauthorized recording. No drugs, no groping. Someone catch your eye? You do not grab them. You find them in the catalog, <laughs> ask for a BD, and get yourself a box. I really How does this work? Like, like, I don't know. Mm-hmm. Doors open. Have fun, doll. Okay, thanks. Welcome to Lizzie's. Safe area. Good. Oh, thank you. Surprisingly, it's not as it's more calm than I thought it'd be. Hey, oh, I thought it was Johnny for a sec. It's like we get to meet Johnny already. That karaoke. Hey. Hey. Bartender. Get Whoa. you something. Can I get you? Lizzie still works here. So curious. The name Lizzie's. That the owner? Not for a long while, no. And it's none too sweet a story. Hey, what well, happened? No, I'm just flat interested. The real Lizzie ran a strip joint out of this place back in the day. Lizzie's bar. Girls were paid right, insured, even had decent security. Good spot, all in all. Good old days. I like stories about him. Let me guess. What happened? It didn't last. No. Tiger Claws took care of that. Tiger beat one of Lizzie's girls real bad once. No hesitation. Oh, Lizzie Tiger. The guy's balls off. We Gang came back the next day. Ah. Liz was done. The Tigers fight we saw earlier. To the mocks in the end, though, didn't they? Sort of. The Moxes had to make a deal with them. Luckily, they kept their heads organized quick. Big boss now is Susie Q. But the sign stayed up. Out of respect. And biz booms to this day. Yeah, Tiger. That's one of that's the fight we saw earlier. It was like Tiger versus I forgot what. Looking for Evelyn Parker. Know if she's here? Who's asking? A big tipper? Name's V, okay. Name's V. She and I have a date. Well, V, it's a pleasure. I'm Mateo. Mateo. Uh, so, Evelyn. Club's big. We're gonna have to look around. Can't do it for you. Oh, damn. It's all right, Mateo. You don't know. Oh! Evelyn. You're right there. <gasps> Hi. Oh. I'm kind of nervous all of a sudden. <laughs> Evelyn Parker. I, knew I like your outfit. As soon as you walked in. Ah. Drink. Hmm. Take my tequila of choice. Sense on. Only tequila I drink. Hm. How would you know? You I like to know me? everything about the people I work with. Oh. Either that or it was just a lucky guess. You read on your research, eh? Why meet here? What's that? Six at next to it. Why we meet near? Any particular reason? Actually, it doesn't seem much like your thing, this place. <laughs> really? She fits um, right in. I'll take that as a compliment. Come on. No place we can talk where ears won't prick up to listen. All right, we'll be in the lounge, Mateo. If anyone asks, we're not here. VIP room. Oh wow. Oh. Got a stripper here. Enjoy the view. <laughs> Dex had a load to say about you. Called you professional, effective, and trustworthy. I hope he wasn't overselling. I'm the best. You don't care about... You don't care what... Oh, okay. You don't give a rat's dick what Dex thinks. We both know that. 
You have trouble accepting compliments? No. Just think flattery's beneath you. Am I wrong? Maybe Dex is beneath you. Hmm. Have you known each other long? Uh... What, you're writing Dex's bio? You writing Dex's bio? Hate to disappoint, but... I just don't know much. In other words, you hardly know each other. Yeah. Yet he fingered you for this job. You just met him an hour ago. Curious. Let's cut to the chase. What do you got for me? Your target. I trust you know what it is. Relic. Secure your soul trinket. Key tech in the program, actually. We're tangling with Arasaka. Making this heist one dangerous, risky motherfucker. Mm-hmm. Arasaka's poured billions into personality transfer technology. But me, I just want the data on this one. The chip is tucked away inside Compeki Plaza, the hotel. You ever been? Never had the opportunity. You know, just never rolled through that neighborhood. Damn shame. The fresh they serve is sinfully good. Chef must have made a deal with the devil. So where's this chip hiding, exactly? In a suite on the top floor. The room's occupied by Yorinobu Arasaka. Yorinobu the Arasaka. The actual As Arasaka? <laughs> Don't you read the scream sheets? The media couldn't get enough of Yori coming to Night City. It was all over the headlines. Anyway, he's heir apparent to the Arasaka Empire. Oh, okay. Saburo Arasaka's but, yeah. only surviving son. What, so Arasaka Jr. is planning to grab the reins while in Night City? Only a handful of people in Night City know what the Arasaka's real plans are. Telling me you're one of them? And what is it? Yorinobu's got an army around him, I bet. Top dog like Yorinobu's bound to have an army on call. Hotel's probably a goddamn fortress by now, too. Yeah. Yorinobu How do we get in? No hustle around. Not one guard. Got rid of them a long time ago. Why? Huh. Why is that? And he's important. Surely you know what they say about Arasaka Into. Sneeze in Night City, and a blossom drops from a cherry tree in Tokyo. Yorinobu was convinced his Arasaka security detail reported directly to his father. So we're not jumping the corp. We're jumping Yorinobu Arasaka. Straight himself. to the top dog. Yorinobu is a puppet. He lost all his cards years ago when he failed to do daddy's bidding. Saburo's had Yuri's balls in a vice for years. He might just turn the screw and crush them outright if he learns his son's up to no good again. Look, if you've got any spare aces up your sleeve, now's the time to show them. Now this should make your tits perk up. Oh. Yorinobu yeah. recently swiped the chip from an Arasaka laboratory. He's made a deal with Netwatch, aims to sell it to them. Have you spotted my ace yet, or do I need to spell things out? So what's Norinobu slated to get in return? Netwatch, something that doesn't add up. What is Netwatch? Wait, neutral Netwatch is mixed up in this? Netwatch provides net security for all corporations, and collects eddies in the millions for it. But, in this day and age, everyone's in the game. And no one can afford to be a saint. To win, one has to go all in. Fine. So no Arasaka security on the device, because Yorinobu whisked it away in secret. Now where's he hiding it? Well, likely in a specialized container. One that mimics an organic neural environment. On the outside, it looks like an ordinary briefcase. And the case is? You'll see for yourself soon enough. Provided we're done gossiping about the Arasakas. What else do you know about this dude? What else dude? do you know about Yorinobu? Quite a bit, actually. He studied finance and biotech in Tokyo. <laughs> Probably didn't have a choice in the matter, come to think of it. Saburo was grooming him to be his successor. But then Yorinobu vanished to chase his own dreams. Cut himself off from the corp for years. Long story short, Though the black sheep returned, the bitter taste remained. But that's only one side of him. There's another. An intelligent man who has always walked his own path. 
and so has his own designs on the corp. Maybe he's got a taste of power. Could be another power hungry corpo dick, like so many others. <laughs> Ever tried to imagine what life might be like for an emperor's son? You have everything, yet you are no one. Nothing. At least as long as you remain in Saburo Arasaka's shadow. I sympathize. It's a vulnerability I understand well. Oh, what's your background, what Evelyn? You to exploit fully. What's on this relic? One more thing. Data that's on the chip. Yeah, why is it so what valuable? It? Irrelevant entirely. Ugh, of course. We're talking about data She's hiding. Out of Arasaka. What's more, he wants to pass it on to Netwatch. Sounds pretty damn relevant to me. Listen, V. The relic. That's my concern. Your concern? Earning a paycheck. Confidential information. Done. I'll make sure your bank accounts are sated. Okay, fine. Okay. We won't be too What's nosy next? now. Now comes the best part. Follow me. Got something for you. Should help you plan. Brain dance from Compeki Plaza. Ooh, brain dance. What's a brain dance supposed to help? Need facts, not thrills. <laughs> Think BDs are only good for fondling virtual tits? Jacking off to in those boxes? No. It can be a very useful tool. Good for analyzing details, human perception, even boosted. Doesn't grasp. Exactly what you need. Mm, so nice dressing room. Yorinobu's suite. Pretty. The glorious interior. You'll need to locate the relic yourself. Hope I grabbed enough detail to make that possible. Hold up. You mean to say you recorded this? Mm hmm. BD rec implant. Why, you object? Okay, let's go. So you know Nori Nobu personally? Supposed to be Yorinobu's pad on the tape. Means you were inside. You, uh, know each other? How else could I get all this intel? Oh, I know him pretty well, been, actually. You guys were dating? We have an arrangement. Strictly, oh, strictly business. business. Suits us both, I think. Let's see this brain dance. Judy Our first... Help. She's a mox, too. First brain Besides, dance. We go back, uh, years. She's just, she's not the, giving us all the info, eh? Important. Judy's always been there for me. Always helped out. I trust her. But all she's right. a mox. Not the latest member of your crew. Try not to forget. So you'll be a good girl, tread lightly, and keep that tongue on a leash. Relax. Yes, ma'am. Believe it or not, I'm no stranger to tact. In biz or life. Oh, look at all this info. <clears throat> ah, yes. We saw her in um in the trailer. Hey, there you are. She looks cool. This is v. She's here for that BD role. And V, this is Judy. Best brain dance editor I know. Enough already. You're gonna make me barf. <laughs> Quite the setup here. Impressive looking setup. Need all this to process brain dances? Mm hmm. Analyzers, sensory SIG amps, acoustic and emotive wave monitors, facial expression translators. <clears throat> Judy. She's getting carried away. All right, all right. Compiled your BDF. What do you think? Will it do? Still pretty raw, but yeah, ought to do. Mm hmm. V needs to get deep inside. That's most important. So, let's calibrate. Tune it to her. Show me. Show me the dance. Believe me, I've dealt with worse. You should see the jig jig street porn we gotta contend with sometimes. So, we drop V inside? Let her look, let her rummage around, right? How about it, V? Raw brain dance. Ever taken a dip before? Nah, I'm a virgin. I think I can take it. I think I can handle it. Let's just do this. Right into right it. On. Sit down. Settle in. And we'll get you going. Okay, hit me. Just promise me it won't hurt. It won't. Not this time. Now sit still. Look at me. Gonna run the analysis soft. Should feel a slight tingling. Mm-hmm. 
Okay, now let's set the optics and other sensory sigs. Look smack into these two screens. Pretend it's an eye exam. You do the soft end? Get a lot of requests like this. All the time. But it's usually stuff the girls scroll at the club. I take that and do some routine porn to me. <laughs> Crank up the orgasms? More like cut out all the other shit. Fucking's business as usual for these guys. Their minds wander to grocery lists, spouses' birthdays, late bills, whatever. But even then, you can refigure things, mold the emotions into something unique, unforgettable. So, I can't complain. Is this like a dream that we're gonna go into? VR, but more realistic. Okay, all set. You need to test your profile first. Tossing in a sample BD. You can use it to get to know the editor. Now let me see. Where could we? Can't you just use my recording? Why are we wasting time? So we don't <laughs> risk our necks. Sides won't take a sec. Got something here. Should be perfect. I feel like I'm a guinea pig or something. Boot it up. The way I'm locked in this chair. The tailored version first. As you get your bearings, then we'll jump into editing mode. Be diving in and. Oh. Uh... <laughs> so we've transported. Do nothing odd. Don't oh, yeah. This was in the. Snatch the cash. Get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. This was one of the trailers. And remember. Everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. I'm not the trailer, but one of the gameplay videos they showed, eh? Okay, on you go. Alright. So we can go experience. So it's just a movie we've watched, we don't need to uh, touch anything. On the ground! What I see you kissing the flooring! Money! Now! Or I will Ooh. fucking drop you, I swear to god! Whoa! Yeah! Uh, uh, now! Before I blow your fucking head off! See you later. Slow, deep breaths. Your cortisol and adrenaline spiked, but the soft activated your hormone blockers. Nothing happened. You're alive and well. That was too that much. Was too much. Felt it. it could feel the guy's pain. Mm, everything. His stress. His hope. Hope wrapped up in something else. Mm-hmm. Probably took a booster just before. You were oh, fine. yeah. Got everything set up. Let's switch over to editing mode. Oh, let's go. Yeah, I remember watching a video about this part. Or how we can go back and look at each detail. I'll sever the link to the BD Roller's sensory array. You'll be able to look around freely. All seems yours. Full cam control and analysis mode. So move around, zoom in and out, whatever else you come up with. Think of it as your own little sandbox. So in like analysis a... mode, you control playback. Can even pause when you feel the need. Then but like a little fly flying around. Snatch the cash. Get out, and we sell the BD to those psycho <laughs> freaks from the studio. Got this, it, got is, this will be really good, eh? Right. The no, flight. That's not all. You can speed things up or rewind, whatever you like. Give it a try. Rewind. Uh, Roll rewind. it back to the top. All good. Neat. Now try fast-forwarding a bit. Okay. You can also reset the recording. That'll take you right back to the beginning. Try it. Reset. Now for some fun. Oh, yeah. This here's why you came in the first place. In analysis mode, you get to view and even scan details of the enviro recorded by the BD roller. Focus on the heat. The gun this gonk gets from his buddy at the beginning. Now scan it. Okay, yeah, this will be so go. good in like if we had okay, this technology right for like police and detectives nowadays, eh? Bold section on the track indicate a scannable clue. The clue will be highlighted by the duration of the sequence if the editor is set to the correct layer. Clues may overlap each other. The spot where they overlap on the recording track will be especially bright. After being successfully scanned, clues disappear from the track. Can scan his pistol. Excellent. Let's move on. Now heads up. 
in analysis mode, you can ferret out background noise and conversations if the roller got close enough. This tech records everything, every little detail, even the sights and sounds the roller was never aware of. To see the sources of the recorded sensory signals, switch to the audio layer in the editor. Go ahead and try that now. Okay, good. Now you should see several sound signatures in the store. Choose one and hone in on it. Mm, oh yeah. Okay, fuck! On you ah, little shitheads! Ooh, go who's restock. That? I'll take the register. How about you suck a bag of dicks, eh? Oh yeah. So, any thoughts? Some robbers, is it? Unbelievable. Seriously, like it was happening right next to me. Yeah, it's how BD recording implants work. They pick up everything, all the elements in the background. Then an editor tweaks them, makes them pop. Keep playing with the sounds, explore it a bit. We'll move on when you get bored. Yeah, everybody! Sometimes you can analyze extra layers in the raw. Stuff the roller is cyberware picked up. Like what? Ev's got Kiroshi optics that grab infrared, meaning you should be able to grab heat signatures from her recording. Huh. Hella nice. Now let's wait till the guy punches out the gonk at the counter. Okay. On the ground! Wanna see you kissing the flooring? Money! Scanning works on peeps, too. Walk up to the wounded chick. Who is he? All right, next thing. Scroll forward to the part where our artist gets a lead injection. Ah. Uh, yeah. See that? They shot him and he never saw it coming. But you will. Here it comes. My favorite part of the, the game. sky. See the blinking thing you over the shot him. Surveillance cam. Must have caught our shooter. You'll see him ah. second. Cam feeds to the screen behind the clerk. Roll back to where the screen's in the kid's field of vision, then scan it. Butch there. Cool, we can see the face of the dude. And then can we scan that screen? His own chumba shot him. Probably planned to all along. Must have got a nice slice of cred on the black market for a BD like this. BD freaks are ready to pay a preem for a real flatline. Anyway, if you've seen enough, you can exit. Yeah, that will be buzzy. Impressive, right? It's too bad most of the BDs we do here are only good for flogging the log. Anyway, you ready to do this? Look at your wreck? I don't know. I... Ugh, let's take a break. Still feel like that kid when... Yeah. When he got Hang shot. V, there's no time. Get it together, please. Okay. Okay. Go ahead. Just need T Buck to link in. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Who? Runner for my crew. Security specialist. She'll tell me what to look for while we analyze. No problem, I hope. Actually, it is a problem. Not what we agreed, Ev. Can trust Judy. T-Bug's a professional, discreet to a fault. You can trust her. Why? Because you say so? Mm-hmm. Please, Judy. Let's be... Never let's meet you halfway. Danger. You know that. Meet halfway here, guys. Okay, V. Call T-Bug and we'll dive in. Hey, V. What's happening? Bug, listen. I got some useful footage from Konpeki Plaza. It's a brain dance. Con Pecky. Oh, thought as much. Someone there with you? Judy and Evelyn. Evelyn. They're chill. They're helping me work through this BD. Uh-huh. All right. You gonna tell me what this is about? Listen. Need your help. Got no clue what to look for once I'm in. All right, see if I can walk you through it. Jacking into your tech now. Mm, you've got to give me access. Opening port 1779. Secure protocol? Good, I'm going in. Should be getting my request now. Oh. Got it. You ready? A millisec. Okay, connection confirmed. Now some quick dip ice and we're clear. Ready to dance. <laughs> ready to dance. This is cool. I'm liking this like girl team. 
All these girls are so like onto it. And intelligent. Harvey, eyes open. Gotta find out where Yurinobu's keeping the relic. Okay, so we're currently Evelyn. Oh! You look like a Terminator. Meat, are you? Evelyn. She Scary. I felt her fear. Terminator. Control quick too. I said no. You already know my head for this. Then you shall perish for a good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute. Listen in on that conversation, V. Could be something important. I need a minute to finish. The program is still in the trial phase. We cannot take it to market as is. We shall see soon enough. Please speak with your father. He's taken a particular interest in this project. He can certainly explain the risks. My father is a tired, visionless old greybeard who thinks nothing will change and he'll live forever in his tiny frozen bubble. I should not even be listening to such things. You will listen to this. Saburo is an adult despot, utterly removed from reality. Stuck in some fossilized vision of a world that no longer exists. Of a world that may never have existed. We have not seen eye to eye for the past 20 years. I am quite sure we want now. Read the documentation carefully. The relic requires specific storage conditions. You must no, provide them. In Heard that? Relic docs gotta be around here somewhere. Look for them. Okay. In the visual layer, scan Naughty Nobu's data pad while it's turned on. Okay. But yeah, the way that Evelyn's dressed, it looks like she's here on a date with him. I don't know. She looks so nice in that dress there. Oh, this is foam. Where's his data pad? Is that it? Shit, camera's packed with new tech. Motion sensors, heat sig activators, IFF. You skilled enough to kill it all? Mucho more than enough. Just need access to their subnet. Alarm system. Alarm firmware's fresh. But, saw excited birds chirping on a BBS. Something about lots of seeds falling to this sieve. Let me generate keys. I can forge their six. And this Terminator dude. Okay. Sorry to make you wait. Business. Can be stupid. Hmm. It wasn't long. Yeah, wasn't long. some romance, no not just business. Is everything alright? Oh! Edgy. A moment. It will pass. <sighs> I can get to work on it. Just to... Anna. Just... One condition. You <laughs> wish to make demands of Where's the data pad? Only one. Focus. On me. Oh, got any candy left? Stuff Where's your data pad? Pretty fun last time. Bedroom. Nightstand. Oh, I've damn. Got an idea. Be right back. Wait, I think this, this is where his data pad is. Oh, where is your data pad? Nightstand. I've got an idea. Be right back. This is the data pad. No, it wants me to go back there. What can I scan around here? Okay. Cool. Automated turrets. Latest scanner model. System is all connected to the server. Can you shut them off? Externally? No way. Gotta get in, check out how they link into the system first. Very nice. But come here Ooh. already. Messages. Just a sec. Looking for the perfect thing. Ah, oh, you'll like this. Whoa. This is so nice. Just how it controls everything, the mood, the lights. Oh, fuck, it 
it's like I'm really B. <laughs> B's like, ooh, gross. Mariko, man. I miss this. You. I know. Okay. What's the visual stuff? V's reaction. V's reaction to Evelyn. Okay. Oh, there it is. Is that what we want? Oh, okay. Awesome. Relic needs to be kept real cool. So Chip's got to stay in the freezer. Yep, could damage it otherwise. Okay, switch on thermal layer detection in the editor. Should be easier to spot where you are know who's keeping the chip. It's gun. Loaded. Safety's on. Good to know though. Once you're in there, don't forget about that iron. Scan for thermal clues to find relic. Thermal layer. Okay, R B. Thermal clues. Oh, there we are. Air conditioning, standard model for hotels of this caliber. Tip matches that stipulated in the docks, but no way the chip's hiding there. Too risky. Tip fluctuations, risk of damage. Okay. Something there. Looks like just another vent, though. Right. Oh, hidden safe. Sig. Matches the spec in the docks. Nice. Your Nobu's got the case here, guaranteed. Mm-hmm. We've got it. Good work. Looks like we got everything we need. Oh. Quit out of the editor. <laughs> Evelyn, you liar! You said it was only for business purposes. Yep. We saw you. That'll do. Thanks. So what you did. We got it. We felt what you Wait, did. <laughs> nice work today. See you soon. I'll wipe the cash and your data. You were never here. Nice. Clear the history. Man, these ladies are so cool. Keep it. I'll put it on Ev's tab. Portable device for handling BDs. I already uploaded your calibration settings. Not as sophisticated as what we got here, but should do the trick. And it keeps you out of harm's way. Clever. Speaking of harm's way, know what I see looking at you? Walking, talking corpses. Oh, why? Relax. I got it all under control. If you fuck up and they come knocking on my door, Judy, relax. That's not gonna happen. Trust in my work. Please, no shortcuts. You go that route, city will always win. So be careful. Of course I will be. Besides, we'll talk in a bit. All right. That was fun. Let's walk. Connection to Nuronobu. What's its nature exactly? We knew what you did. I see how you know so much about Yorinobu. <laughs> it's simple. Men like pillow talk a bit too much. So it's just about the sex. Biz. And biz only. The sex is part of the biz. You sure Nuronobu doesn't suspect You're sure Yorinobu doesn't expect this kind of move from you? <laughs> He's got no idea. Trust me. He's too busy with Netwatch to give me that kind of attention. Besides, even if some suspicion takes root in his mind, it shouldn't matter. He won't react in time. And that's something you'll handle, right? Not afraid I'll tie you to the heist? You're not worried? Arasaka will flag and screen anyone who's had dealings with Yorinobu. Oh, they'll have a long list then. Packed full of big names. Much bigger than mine. You tell me who they check first. Corpo hotshots and cutthroats? Or a little bedroom plaything like me? 
Intel on Yorinobu, the chip, the BD from Compeki. When's a right? Plan's perfect. A job like this comes one in a million. Hmm. Thanks. Now the punchline, please. Just sounds too good to be true. What's the catch? Cold feet. Are you looking to get out of it? I want to know if you're really in control here. Nice talking to you. Intel on your Nobu, the chip, oh, the BD from Compeki. When's a right? Plan's perfect. A job like this comes one in a million. Hmm. Thanks. Now the punchline, please. Just sounds too good to be true. What's the catch? Cold feet. Are you looking to get out of it? I want to know if you're really in control here. That you're not sending me into the sort of shit I can't wait out of. V. I have zero reasons to haze you. We're in this together. Really. Hmm. Trust me that I got this. Okay. So? What now? V. To the hotel. Do this job for me. I mean me alone. No splitting the payout with anyone else. No middlemen. Okay. No Dex. But Dex led us to you. You want to haze our fixer? You want to fuck over our fixer? I knew something was up. That's Dex not cool. Is a middleman, and a useless one at this point. Evelyn, you he don't tied mess us together. Fixers. That's the one rule every merc in this city knows and actually follows. But if we're smart, doesn't matter. Mm, I don't like, like that idea. Cost you your rep. And without a rep, you're nobody. I don't like that. You're sure, you want to do this? Better ask yourself that question. Do you want to spend the rest of your days blasting scabs? Or become a legend overnight? Your choice. No way. I don't like that. No fucking way. Dex took a leap with me. He trusts me. Now I'm doing the same. 50%. With cred like that in your account, you won't need Dex for anything. Oh, but he's the one that tied us together. Nah. Evelyn, it's not just about the money. I'm loyal. I thought you were a We're loyal. I thought it was always about the money. Not behind the back of someone who trusts me. Sorry. Fine. I never asked. But V? Hmm. I just hope you're as good as you are naive. If you need me, call. I'll send you my number. Okay. Not that Good I luck. think Dix trusts us, it's just he's the one that tied us together, words, so. Alright, I think I'm gonna leave the video right here. That was a really fun part. Uh, I feel I like I am you. obviously a bit more Time's comfortable with the. Ah, Elon's getting annoying. How things oh. looking, Miss V? Hey, Dix. Okay, let's talk to him. Turns out Evelyn's recording from Compeki was worth our time. Beautiful. T-Bug already called. Said she's working her magic. And the flathead. Nothing yet. On it now. T-Bug says no chance at that chip without that buy. To work then, Miss V. Oh. All right. That was a very fun part. Finally got to see the brain dance. Um, and gotta test it out and experience it for ourselves yeah that's such a neat type of technology um that i think will be really realistic that it will be really realistic that that kind of technology may actually happen and be made in real life maybe 10 or 20 years time i'm feeling a lot better after this playthrough even though there's a lot of movement a lot of you know, head bobbing and all that. Uh, I feel like the motion sickness pulls really did help. So I might need to continue doing that just to play this game. Hope you guys enjoyed this video here with me. Um, if you did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Let me know in the comments below what you thought about this part of the game. And I will see you in the next video, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye.